I also have looked at that website, usdebtclock.org, and yesterday I was looking at it, and I see that um, it showed $19.8 trillion of debt. And it also has a feature where you can click ahead and ask what's it going to be in four years. And in four years, it's expected to be $22.5 trillion, which is an increase, estimate increase of $667 billion per year. And as I looked at that, um, I figured out how much per day that debt is increasing. It's $1.8 billion per day. And then I was thinking about being on the Appropriations Committee and the, the State of Nebraska General Fund budget is $4.5 billion for the year. Well, the, um, at $1.8 billion a day, <clears throat> excuse me, you spent you spend the Nebraska annual budget in 59 hours. In other words, every two and a half days, the federal debt increases by the amount of Nebraska's annual general fund budget. And as I was, oh, I'd like to mention that I'm wearing a pink shirt today in honor of my new granddaughter. And as I was thinking about my new granddaughter born Friday night, I uh, looked on that uh, website and also said how much debt per citizen there is. Well, per citizen, there's $61,156 of debt. So my new two and a half day old granddaughter has now inherited $61,150 of federal debt. And she's two and a half days old. The, uh, this website also lets you to project ahead. And at age 18, at the way it's increasing now, she'll uh, graduate high school with $85,900 worth of federal debt against her, um, and then may have started student loans of her own. And I uh, just am concerned that the rate of growth that is, uh, that it's not sustainable, and something needs to be done about it. Sign the petition at cosaction.com and get as many of your friends and family to do the same. With your full address, your state legislators will know that you really are their constituents in their district. Our success depends on you. So we're inviting you to be part of history. Let's invoke the constitutional solution that's as big as the problem.